Yo, what is up everybody and welcome back to round two coverage of the Romeo and Juliet Championship here on the European Tour for the TGC Tours. Yesterday's round we shot a six under. Right now the cut line is a 14 under, so we need at least an eight under here. I would say to even be more safe, probably a nine under. And it's something that we can do, I believe. We didn't have the best of rounds in round one. Decent round. Really wish we would have made some of the putts that we had, but we did make some big putts. And hopefully we can just continue that putting streak alive here in round number two. Real quick, I'm super excited for the new uh, golf club PGA Tour 2K21. I am really pumped for whatever they give us on the 14th. Hopefully it's a release date. I I'm just I'm just super, super excited to get a new game for golf to play on this channel. I'm super pumped and I'm ready for it. And hopefully... Uh, we get it. It's a smooth transition for the TGC tours, and we just go right into the new game. I'm I'm excited to see what they what they show us uh, next week. Also, we hit 200 subscribers. Thank you very much for the support. Uh, we stepped on a lot of toes and probably pissed a ton of people off to this point, but we're up over 200 subscribers, and I just want to thank you all who have taken the time to not only watch my videos but to subscribe, come into the comment section, like the videos, everything. Thank you very much for watching and enjoying my content. Much more to come. Much more to come. We have a ton of stuff coming out on the channel. When the golf club, new golf club comes out, there's going to be a ton of content for that too. Uh, I'm really pumped for what this year holds for sure. Back to the task at hand though. We have round number two. We need an eight under at least. Eight under is going to be kind of close. Nine under will probably be safe right at the cut line. So let's go out and get it done. We have moderate fairways, moderate greens, fast green speed again, high wind speed, and the wind direction is the southeast. So a lot of those par fives are actually going to have the wind at our back, which should be a fun time. Let's hop out. Round number two. Go out and kill it. Make the cut. Get it into the weekend. Here we go. All right, O'Hara Lynx. It's time for you to be dominated, all right? It is time. Not exactly the way I want to start it off, but it'll work. Rather get my tempo under control completely for this entire round. <laughs> Damn. We have modern green too, so we can attack some. I thought that was going to come off a little bit more right, but it did not. Looks cool, baby, but we can make chips. Wow, look, that's dead straight right there. We slowed it, but... Ooh. We made a chip. Now if we just can get a bunch more of those birdies, that'd be... Oh, that'd be great. That would be spectacular. Not even going to take a chance. This is a perfect spot right here. There's distance. That's right on line. A little long. Should still be able to make this, though. That's surprising it went a little a little long. Not bad, not bad. I'm also uh just so you guys are aware, I'm going to be coming out with a couple of videos um because some people have actually told me in not only comments but dms that the tip videos are good but they can learn just as much just by watching me so i'm actually going to be coming out with a couple of videos where i go over i go on i play a round or two and i take you through everything that i'm thinking about throughout the entire round every shot every putt 
like why I'm lofting it, why I'm de-lofting it, things of that nature. Uh, so be on the lookout for that too. Hopefully it helps you guys. Uh, hopefully it helps you guys some more with, you know, just, man, improving with the golf club. So be on the lookout here in the next couple of weeks for that series that I'll be doing. And that's okay. Sometimes, sometimes a par saves just as good. And should have kept the four iron. I thought that'd actually get carried up a little bit more. I'll put this. All we gotta do is just hit the pin. I would have hit that a little bit harder. That would have been gold. We're still two under. Not bad. A lot of chances to score here. Should have stepped with the four iron. I should have just stuck with it. Oh well. Bummer, dude. Slow it into that wind. That's that's a hard knock life right there. Distance probably would have been okay on that. hard. Too hard. Need to hit that hill a little bit, uh, a little bit lighter. That would have broke right into the hole. Just a little too hard. Kind of beat through that downhill slope a little bit. That's okay. I don't slow it into that, and we have a lot better of a shot, so. I just need to not fucking slow it into that. Get in there. Oh. Damn it. I don't fast that there, and that might actually be in the hole. That would have hit and rolled a little bit. We still got a birdie. I can't be I mean, I'm not mad about it, that's for sure. We still got a freaking birdie, but... Just don't fast it there, you know, and I'd probably be all right. All right. For the most part, though, my tempo has been a lot better than it has been in the past, that's for sure. So, I am very happy about that. It's going to come back down the hill. Or it's going to stop right at the top of the hill. Man, come on, Zane. You just talked about you just talked about it, and you just slowed it. I don't know how that didn't roll down. Fast greens. It's actually 
That's interesting. I guess hitting into an upslope made it die in its tracks. I did loft it up too. I'd say it's straight. It was hard though. I didn't. I don't hit it that. I don't hit it that hard, and that's probably butter right there. It's just too hard. We haven't made those big putts like we did round one. Still okay though. See what the wind does. Stick a little for me. This is putt's gonna be all downhill, kind of a nightmare. Don't hit it too hard on this one. Oh, <laughs> need to be a little harder. I actually got a little scared. I got a little scared that I was going to hit it too hard. And I ended up short in the son of a bitch. Alright, part five. We need a big bomb here. I don't think we're going to be able to make it up, though. If I can get it up, like, here, I'm all right with that. Get it uphill for a chance at, a, at a, uh, an eagle. <laughs> I'll just do that. Don't go bunker. Oh, my God. Great. I might go down the hill and back. Man, dude. I hate it. I hate putting myself in a position where I get a freaking par on a par 5. Oh my god, nothing hurts me more. A little too hard again. Not by much. My pacing is off right now. All right, we need a five under on the back. We need a five under on the back. Preferably a six. So we got to get this done here. I had to very fast that too, would huh? You had to do that, right, Zane? Always put yourself in a situation like this. Okay. Good way to start it. Time to focus up. Great. Oh, this is going to be so bad coming back in. Please just go off the green. Thank you. Holy cow.
break, break in there, break in there. I actually came off a little bit straight on my lie. I thought that was going to come off a little bit more right on my lie. Four under. And if we could get a five under. I need to get it. I need to put that a little bit more left. That's my bad. This should be really good. Yes, it is. Okay. All right. Another birdie. Okay. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Five under. Four more under. Get an eagle here. Quick little eagle here. Quick little eagle here. Oh, that's too much. I don't think that's going to be enough, though. I don't want to overshoot, though, and be coming down that hill. That'd be terrible. I'll take a, I'll take a chance on a chip in for an eagle here. Dude, coming down that hill, that'd be, that'd be really bad. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. Okay, another birdie. We got another par five, too. A lot harder to hit in, in uh, two, but we at least still got another par five. I am cutting this close. Lie killed me there. All right, like I said, sometimes saving a par is really big. Six under. On hole 15, I'm feeling all right. Hmm. I should have just fired it. It was probably going to go long. I still shot it. that slope. I lofted it too much. Damn. I needed to go that little bit extra. Not another yard. I am still cutting it really close. We need to stop. We need a big, big hole here. Need a big couple of holes here. If we could birdie out, that would be absolutely phenomenal. This is a hard green to come into where the pin is. Because of that.
Really? Really? You soar out on me that much when I loft it? Really? Twenty-five and make the sink. I didn't make it. Don't worry. For a lot of the break at beginning, I should have known better. All right, we need an eagle here. At least a birdie. We have to at least get a birdie. If we want any shot. Eagle would be absolutely phenomenal, though. We don't have the wind in our favor, so that's probably not going to happen. Did get a fast, though. I thought that was going to go rough. And I'm like, oh, I go, there goes that. Yeah, we can't get up there. We'll play it up over here to the right. Try to get that birdie. We need we need two birdies here to even have a shot, so. I got a little aggressive there, I probably shouldn't have. Okay. All right, we need another birdie and hope everybody doesn't play as good. This is a big hole. Please don't be rough. This is a big hole right here. I needed to get that more right. I have to play with this uh, bunker. Oh boy, with the wind, downhill lie, what are you going to do to me? Come back, please, some. You need more. Well, this isn't a big putt or anything. <laughs> this isn't a big putt or anything. Okay. Just a little too long. I'm going to get a little aggressive with this. I kind of have to. Alright, how do I want to play this? Breaking quite a bit all the way. Kind of tails off at the end, though. I'm going to hit this a little hard. Try to get through most of this break at the beginning, and hopefully we can hit cup. GG, you missed the cut by a stroke. Damn, that is highly unfortunate. Damn, that was a big putt and I missed it by inches. Oh, it doesn't matter. 14 under just dropped out. It's 15 under. <laughs> we finished two strokes off. It doesn't matter. Man, well, you can't you can't make every cut. I think I'm actually doing all right. I think I'm in the 80s right now. 80% cuts made. I'll be in the seven. I'm 76 right now. That's still really good. Three quarters of my cuts I make. This course was tough. I feel like I didn't have the right clubs a lot of the time. I was in between clubs almost, you know, the entire time on this course. Uh, the course was tough. The greens were tough. I didn't make the putts I needed to. I did first round, second round, I just didn't. My tempo was a little off in the second round, too. Good effort.
I can't be upset with that effort. I, I put up I put up a good effort. And we're not gonna get a demotion mark, so we'll be alright. That is unfortunate though. I don't know if I am I mean I'm almost done with the other the other videos. Maybe I'll release those tomorrow and Saturday. We'll see what I do. I'm either going to do that or I'm going to uh, just do a couple of new courses that I've been wanting to play for the videos. We'll see what happens. Be on the lookout for that, though. Thank you for joining me for this video, though. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, if you made it this far in the video, again, thank you very much for the continued support and also for getting me up over 200 subs. Uh, that means a lot. And thank you very much for, for what, taking your time, taking your time to watch these videos. I greatly appreciate it. I'll be back tomorrow with something, uh, either another like inside my mind round tips video or uh, a couple of courses I've been wanting to play. So be on the lookout for that. And as always, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like on the video or think about subscribing to the channel. We do this every week. A ton of new golf club content coming. New golf club being announced or already announced. Full details next week. That's coming. Uh, if you haven't, haven't subscribed yet, think about doing it now. I would appreciate it very much. I also stream live over at twitch.tv slash respawn TV. We're over there Monday through Friday starting at 8 o'clock Eastern time. If you're interested in the live side of things, you can find me over there. I hope you have a great rest of your morning, afternoon, and evening, wherever you are in the world, though. And we'll catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Deuces.